Today saw the last day of action in the Commonwealth 10-pin bowling championships. Top competitors from 16 countries across the globe have been battling it out all week at the International Ice Bowl in Dundonald. Colin McAlinden has been following this week's action. Now, for the casual bowler, a trip to the International Ice Bowl in Dundonald would normally involve a ball that looks something like this. But this week, it's been balls like this that have been more of the norm. It all began last Sunday with a spectacular opening ceremony in the Ice Bowl. Representatives from the home nations were joined by bowlers from as far away as Australia, Canada and Malaysia. Also present were top dignitaries from the bowling world, including Commonwealth President Julian Pache Bonello, as well as the Mayor of Castlereagh, Anne-Marie Beatty. We've had already had the World Championship team here before 1996 and we've had the Triple Crown a few times. Uh, just a few months ago we had it again and I think we're well known throughout the world and we hope that it will be you know, really, really great for Castlereagh and for Northern Ireland. After a series of good performances, the week began with high hopes for the Northern Ireland team who were hoping to be inspired by some illustrious company. It's wonderful to see so many top bowlers here with us. I mean, we have world and European champions on our doorstep and to play with those, those people is, is a real privilege. It wasn't to be for Northern Ireland though, with bowling heavyweights Malaysia and Singapore dominating the medal table. However, an excellent overall performance saw England take golds in the women's doubles and team events. There was also an English gold in the prestigious all-event category for Zara Glover, who was pleased with her team's overall performance. I've had a really good week this week. We secured the team medal as well as I won the all-event, so they're the two jewels in the crown really, so it was a really good week. Despite a lack of medals for the home team, president of the Northern Ireland Ten Pin Bowling Federation, Billy Beatty, says the week has been a huge success. The week has absolutely flown in. Uh, when this all started in its infancy a year ago in the planning, we thought, oh, with plenty of time. But since it started on uh, Sunday, it has just flown by. And in fairness, the competitors have been fabulous.